Hi, it's George again from e Imports for Less. Here today filming a short video about a vehicle that we just traded in last night. This vehicle's been an e Imports for Less car for less than 12 hours. Uh, this is a 2003, this is a Volvo S80. We'll take a quick walk around here. This car's got 260,000 miles on it. Now, if you know e Imports, you know this is not our normal type of inventory. This is a type of car that we take in on trade and we just sell as is. If we can sell it within a couple of days, that's great. We'll sell it for basically an auction value. If it doesn't get sold, it'll just go to the auction within a couple of days. So let's take a quick walk around. This car is actually pretty presentable. Uh, the exterior of the car is in pretty good shape, and I'll show you a couple of, of sore spots here in a second, but let's take a quick walk around. The majority of these, especially with this kind of miles, forget about the miles, but you know, in a 2003 are you know banged up here and there and rubbed all around the bumpers and stuff, but this car is in pretty good shape and the wheels are in nice shape. It's a nice looking set of wheels on it. Um, but if you take a look up here at the uh, at the front bumper on this corner, that needs to be clipped back in. I'm not sure if that's a screw or a clip or something that that's missing. Um, so our technicians have not looked at this car, and they're not going to. This is the type of car that we will not waste their time on. We're not going to detail it. We're not going to inspect it. You can see that the Pennsylvania State inspection expired back in July, and due to COVID, a lot of people didn't get their cars reinspected just because you don't really have to. Uh, they're given a lot of leniency on that stuff, but. Our technicians are not going to waste a minute of time looking at it. So the, the, the three minute look over that I gave it is all that this is going to get. Um, so you're welcome to come and check it out in person if that's what you want to do. Or watch the rest of this video and I'll show you some sore spots. So you can see some scrapes here on the corner of this bumper. Um, I think in the back back here there was a ding. This, uh, this fuel door here is not latching quite right. I don't know if that's just not going in there. I think the lock mechanism is not working right. Um, but around here there was a door ding on this side uh, let's see right in front of that rear door handle nothing big it's smooth the paint's not broken so not bad the interior is really the sore spot of this car this was never uh, oiled up or taken care of in any way we ran a uh, just a car wash on this one it hasn't been vacuumed or anything and like I said our detail shop is not going to detail this car this is the way that it's going to be bought this is the way it's going to be picked up so let's take a look at the back seat here we will pop the hood and take a look under there. But again, these seats have never been, um, you know, like leather lotion or anything like that put on them. You can tell that. Trunk is pretty clean. It's dry in there. Let's take a look around this side. And start the car for you in a second as well. Show you that. So passenger side. Looks a lot like the driver's side, better condition obviously in the seat. This one wasn't sat in all the time. But let's start it up and, uh, and show you. There's no warning lights on, the AC blows ice cold. Um, there's a, a maintenance reminder, I think that comes on. So you can see that's where the check engine light is on that right side. The airbag light, those are the important ones. As soon as the car gets to temperature, those go off. 260,846 miles and here's your warning over there your your reminder that it's time for regular service and also uh, passenger doors open of course the driver's doors open and you have a low beam uh, a light that's out that's the right headlamp that's out but you can hear the car running the AC is blowing cold let's take a look under the hood I'll show you about that so again we haven't cleaned it we haven't touched it Let's see if I can get this open. So you see it just in the raw the way that it is. So it's actually pretty dry under here um, for a car of this age. And like I said, forget about the miles because, you know, 260,000 miles may seem like a lot, but on a car of this age, it's actually pretty normal. Alternator looks fairly new. Um, but overall, the car's running nice. It's idling nice. And um, see here that that headlamp is out. It's going to need a new bulb or a new lamp. Um, so overall a very presentable car for just a cheap wholesale car that's going to get you around if you need a good train station car or a starter car for somebody it's, uh, you know obviously Volvo's known for their safety so not a bad car to start with and overall pretty good looking car nobody would ever guess that this had this kind of miles so check it out all the photos uh, details Carfax report VIN number all that at eimports.com if you're interested in owning this one you want to buy it before it heads to the auction 215-249-9100 Thanks for checking it out.